The church basement ladies have been entertaining audiences at the Plymouth Playhouse for years. But now the men of East Cornucopia Lutheran are finally getting their time in the spotlight in a new musical comedy. It is called Rise Up. Oh, man. And joining us Love now, it. Dorian Chalmers, who plays Mrs. Elroy Engelson and Jeff March, Mr. Elroy Angerson, the Jeff, De uh, the John Deere dealer. That's right. Very nice I to have you both with us. And nice of <laughs> you to lead the dealership. Well, today it's to my come pleasure. Here. How does it feel? Uh, I mean, obviously, this show is so uh, famous yeah. for the ladies. Mm -hmm. Now to be in on the on the action. Oh yeah, no, it's great. Well, you know, we're celebrating our Diamond Jubilee, and so the oh. men have infiltrated the basement to. Uh, uh, the disdain of uh, the widow Vivian Snoostead, but uh, I'm enjoying it. So. Dorian, was it hard having the men suddenly join in? I know that sometimes they they can cramp the style a little bit. I actually, I think they've ramped up our style. Ooh, so I like it. I do. It's it's been really fun to have the men, and our audiences have responded really well to getting to meet these fellows that we've talked about for so long. You've heard about them yeah. in your original show, but yep. now here you here get they to are. meet them in real life. Yep. Did that make casting hard to have characters that have been talked about for mm. so long or were you like we know <laughs> you know that's my husband right there well actually I recommended Jeff for the job because I thought he would be a perfect foil for for Karen yeah so. we've known each other a long time yeah. and worked together in the theater community here so. give us an idea as to what the plot line is of rise up Omega. well it's um, July 1964 and our community is getting ready to celebrate our diamond jubilee so the men have infiltrated the kitchen to lend a hand in the preparations and as I mentioned, the widow Vivian Snoostead is not too keen on that happening. <laughs> so. I bet that's a lot of fun. It is. Can the men keep up with the ladies, though? Is the million dollar question. We are still the boss of the kitchen. <laughs> we'll always be the boss of the kitchen. We'd like to think we're holding our own, but I'm afraid she's right. I mean, come on. As a man, you know the answer to this question. Oh, yes, so dear. Yes, dear. Yes, dear. Yes, dear. Yes, dear. <laughs> it's really good. Are you finding that uh, uh, that that people who have seen the church basement ladies over the year? I mean, this is a natural that they're they're going to want to come and see this. Absolutely. Right? The people who have seen it are just thrilled that they finally get to meet these new fellows. It brings such a different energy to have the male perspective um, and to see these relationships that we've never seen before mm -hmm. a husband and wife relationship a father relationship um, all of those things that are new to the how it all feels do you think this is something you'll continue in the future will we see more of the men we never say never so who knows uh, <laughs> there could be a church baseball lady seven that's not one on the books at the moment but you know we never say never we keep coming back you cannot keep a good church basement lady down no you sure can't <laughs> you sure can't you got your plate full of bars you're good to go you are exactly. good to go absolutely well rise up O man opens tomorrow at the plymouth playhouse runs through april 8th tickets start at 29 dollars. just go to wcco.com slash links for showtimes and for ticket information. Sounds like a lot of fun. It Thanks does. for coming in. Thank yeah, you thank for you. having me. Good luck with the show. So much Thank you.